myself Ms. TK Tharani Priya, Assistant Professor, School of Commerce, Kaiser College of Arts and Science for Women, Tuchangol. So now we are going to discuss about business law in which unit 4, law of agency. The law of agency is defined as the ability to act through another. In most cases, this applies to commercial relationships or contractual agreements. The most common example of this is in the employer-employee relationship. The employer is authorizing the employee to complete work on their behalf. Creation of agency. A contract of agency may be express or implied. Consideration is not an essential element in the agency contract. Agency contract may also arise by estoppel, necessity or rectification. Agency system is very popular in the current business scenario. There are two parties in the agency system. One is the principal and another the agent. An agent is a person acting on behalf of his principal. It's a connecting link between the principal and the third party. Herein we will discuss the creation of agency under the Indian Contract Act 1872. Classifications of agents. General agent, special agent and mercantile agent. Where general agent, the principal appoints a general agent to do anything within his authority in all transactions or in all transactions relating to a specific trade, business or matter. The principal grants the authority to the agent to act on his behalf, special agent. He is the one who is appointed or employed to do or perform only a specific act, task or function. Outside of this special act, task or function, he has no authority or power. Mercantile agent. As per section 2 subsection 9 of the Sale of Goods Act 1930, a mercantile agent is the person who in the customary course of business has an agent's authority either to sell or consign the goods for the purpose of sale or to buy goods or to raise money on the security of goods. Factors, brokers, del greed agent or some mercantile agents. Termination of agency. Termination of agency is when the relationship between principal and agent comes to an end. An agreed relationship between the principal and the agent by agreement or law by a third party known as agency in the contract. The agent deal with third parties on behalf of the principal. Modes of termination of agency. They are by the act of parties and by revocation agency of operations of law. By act of parties, it is happening on by agreement, revocation by the principal, renunciation by agent. By revocation agency of operation of law, they are completion of business or expiry of time, death of the principal or agent, insanity of principal or agent, insolvency of the principal, subsequent impossibility. Thank you.